What's going on, everybody? This is Darrell with Motivation. The moment today, we're going to talk about pressure, right? Uh, the first point is all pressure really isn't bad. I think that in as we go throughout life, we are always going to have a sense of pressure either by other people or by our from ourselves or from just seeing uh, the successes of those around us. That is a sense of pressure too, right? So you want to be able to manage and understand where actually it's coming from and you want to actually understand because we're our, we're our own worst critic. So we are our own worst critic. We're going to be extremely hard on ourselves. We're going to actually hold ourselves to a higher standard than others hold us to. And that is another sense of pressure within itself. So you can have this exterior pressure coming in and you can have the internal pressure which is also giving you even pressing even more. Uh, so, but not all pressure is bad pressure. And I say that because uh, the second part is, I mean, the second point is you never know how much you can take until you actually have to get through something or you have to prove to yourself that you can do something. I, I, I always relate something to uh, to working out, right? When you get ready to, like you do 12 sets or two sets of 12 or three sets of 12 or I almost said 12 sets of 12, but you get what I mean. Uh, you do like two sets of 12, right? But you're using a comfortable weight. So you're able to crank that rep out, no problem. Now we're gonna do a set of 15, but with heavier weight. So in order to get through this weight, you really have to get your mind together. You really gotta understand that this is a heavier weight. You wanna keep the form that you're doing. You don't wanna try to just fling it up there. You wanna keep your form. You wanna try to finish the set. But in order to get through that, you have to get your mind together. You have to get your mind in the right place, which I talked about uh, on a post today. If y'all if y'all go back and look at that, you'll see that I talked about that today. But the pressure point, really, you never know what you have until you have to you have to pull from it. You have to press yourself to do it. You have to find whatever inner strength you have to get through there. So you never know what you got till you got to use it. Uh, and that that's true for a lot of people. Like most people, I didn't know I, I didn't know I could do that. I didn't. People be like, oh man, I didn't know you had it in you. So it's like because you never had to use it before until you get to a point to where you got to find, you got to dig in your bag and get it out, right? Uh, and the third part is the you having this pressure applied to you or you applying this pressure to yourself could really be the turning point of something, um, something great. So this pressure that's being applied to you on the outside looks like it's a bad thing and it looks like, oh man, they're really going to crack. But really that's the turning point of you reaching the goal. That's the turning point of you being successful. That's the turning point of you breaking a habit. That's the turning point of you actually fulfilling and being the better person that you really want to be. So all this pressure that's happening, and I say that because it's the beginning of the year. So everything is going smooth right now. Uh, come talk to me in March and we'll see if everything's still going as smooth as, it's, as it is now. Right, because we're everybody's happy go lucky, everybody's good, everybody's in a good mood, new year, new me, all that stuff, right? So, but we're gonna see what happens in March if you still have this same energy in March because it's a whole different kind of pressure coming if you feel like you're stagnant. So, and you're gonna and you're gonna feel like that some days, but it's coming. But it's all it's all up to you as to how you deal with these stressors and pressure. It's all about how you react to it. It's all about how you adjust to certain things. It's all about what what tools are you going to make sure you have and make sure you use to fulfill the goal that you set. And you know you know exactly what you set for yourself. So you need to make sure you fulfill those things because as you go, more things are going to happen. Life does not stop just because you get tired. It doesn't. And just because you feel like you're under a little bit more pressure than you're used to, Life's not gonna be like, you know what, you, you're dealing with a lie. I'm gonna go ahead and back off some. Nah, it's coming. It's coming and you can't stop the train. So find a way to deal with the pressure for one and actually use it for your advantage, man. Use it for your advantage because this pressure that's coming, you can actually use it, shape it and, and get it to propel you into where you need to be. So that's your motivational moment for today, man. And as always, act in love and do the right thing because it needs to be done. Y'all take care.